know, you're going to be dreaming another year about a podcast going, why am I not arriving there? It's because you don't have a map. <laughs> the first thing is your why. So you're going to want to define, define that. It is your core source of your motivation. It's the reference point for all of your decisions and your actions. You can have an audience of one niche and you can have a guest pool of a different niche. The ones that were a lot more a lot more successful in attracting the right kind of listener base. They had the the audience. They didn't call it an audience promise. You really can't be anything to anyone if you're trying to be everything to everyone. <laughs> you know, right. I mean, it, it's impossible. The more that you niche down, the better because you're exactly, it's like people are like, wow, are you reaching into my life and changing my life already? You want more of that so that you're inspired to go out and help more people. This is going to be the difference between if you're going to have a successful podcast or if you are not going to have a successful podcast. If you don't understand your audience, how are you going to create content that is going to inspire them to tell their friends about it? Or any woman at 40 or at 30 or at 20 or any entrepreneur who, you know, wants X, Y, Z, um, until you're really getting down into the nitty gritty, they're not going to stick around and you can't get to the nitty gritty if you don't know who they are. If you've never reached over 2000 in revenue and you want to reach 10,000 in revenue every month, then this show is going to help you do that. 